All right. Spill it. I want details. Yeah, so do I. Oh, me too. Well, there is not much to tell. Eddie took me to the restaurant where he had met his ex-wife, Roberta. Well, I would think going to that restaurant would just remind him of her. It did, especially since she owns it, runs it, and calls the place Roberta's. <laughs> As she was seating us, he begged her to come back to him. And after he had wept over his crab cakes, I begged her to come back to him. <laughs> Blanche, I need to talk to you privately. Okay. There's this person, someone I've known for quite a while, and lately there seems to be this attraction developing, uh, an attraction I've been trying to deny. Blanche, what are you doing? <laughs> it's a curse. <laughs> My beauty's always been a curse. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dorothy, but like the fatal blossom of the graceful Jimson weed, I entice with my fragrance but can provide no succor. I'm talking about Stanley, you idiot. Get out of here. Stan has the hearts for me. For me, not you, fatal blossom, for me. Well, well, you got in pretty late last night. I know. So, tell us all about the big weekend. And don't leave out a thing. I want you to start with the sweet nothings he whispered in your ear. Well, okay. Uh, first, he said that I was a very attractive woman. Yeah. And then he said I was fun to be with. Yeah. And then he said he was impotent. <laughs> Dorothy will never tell her. Tell her what? The secret that I don't know. Oh. Rose, there's something you know that you're not telling me. You can ask me all the questions you want. You'll never break me. So you're not in love with this Eddie girl? Oh, no, Ma. Then why are you spending all your time with him? Eddie's a love machine? <laughs> as long as I could. She said she'd tickle me. You're a regular Nelson Mandela, Rose. Oh, I love Tony Ben. Oh, so do I. He was always so sweet to me. Blanche, you dated Tony Bennett? Honey, I did more than date him. He may have left his heart in San Francisco, but he left his shorts on my radiator. <laughs> is back. Her taxi just pulled up. Oh, I wonder if she had a great time on that cruise. She did if she fooled around. <laughs> I can't wait to find out. Uh, look, I want to know just as much as you do, but what happened between her and Arnie is private. And if she wants to talk about it, fine. But if she doesn't, I don't want anybody asking any embarrassing questions. I'm back. So, did you and Arnie play Find the Cannoli? Oh. <laughs> Nothing, nothing, Rose. Just sit down here, honey, and tell us all about your trip. Oh, oh, it was fabulous. The food was delicious, the weather was absolutely gorgeous, and the activities on board ship, well, the list goes on forever. Masquerade balls, hootenannies, tours at the engine room, fashion shows, jazzercise, Las Vegas night, Monte Carlo night, Rio night, Riviera Who night. Who cares, Rose? Did you and Arnie hit the sheets or not? <laughs> Dorothy! I'm gonna unpack. Now, this isn't fair. You have to tell us. No, you don't. But if you go out that door and don't come back in, we'll know you didn't. And if you do come back, that means you did. <laughs> ah! Remember that one time you walked in on me, Dorothy? Oh, yeah. I still remember what you said. Mommy's sick, get help. <laughs> if I had ever caught my parents having sex. But you never walked in on them? Once, but they were only playing leapfrog. <laughs> Here it is. I needed to know when Blanche's real birthday was so I could throw her a party. So I got copies of her birth certificate, her DM Wait a minute. That is an invasion of privacy. What makes you think she wants a party? Everybody wants a party, no matter what they say. 
But if you think we don't really need to know Blanche's real age, then maybe we should... Open the dime envelope. <laughs> I can't believe it. After all these years, we're finally gonna know... We're gonna know the true age of Blanche Devereaux. Deleted by authority of the governor. <laughs> Rose, you know what this means. Yeah. She must have really jumped on this guy's bandwagon. <laughs> you almost got it, Rose. <laughs>